today's video, I am gonna go back and forth between whispering, 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 and soft spoken. This lip oil, lip oil has been my new obsession, obsession. It's getaway. Getaway terracotta. I don't know if it'll focus, but it's from it's from Makeup Revolution. Makeup Revolution. Makeup Revolution. And it is the glazed glazed lip oil. Anyways, welcome channel. I'm so happy that you're here with me today. It's Saturday night when I'm recording this, and I thought I would ramble. So, today's video is really going to be about what type of music I listen to, And I'm definitely gonna incorporate some other triggers. Of course, I have a lot of jewelry on, so probably try to make some jewelry sounds. <coughs> Excuse me. So I hope you don't mind. I have my laptop over here. I have my laptop. I have my laptop over here, so Maybe you just like to listen to people ramble in the background. This will probably be the video for you. I'm gonna try to make this one a little bit longer. say that this video is inspired by the ASMR outdoorsman. His name is Max. I will tag his channel in my description so that you can check him out. So, he's a really, really, really awesome artist and he did a video where he kind of just rambled about his music taste, his music taste, his music taste, his music taste. And I think that kind of stuff is so, so interesting. So, I also 
also really enjoy, really enjoy, really enjoy. I really enjoy um, discovering new music, I guess, and like my my music taste. <coughs> my music taste. You'll see. So, I hope you're doing well today, friend. I'm really happy that you decided to spend some time with me. That makes me feel so special. <laughs> um, and, yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and started. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna start out, start out, by just talking about the 10 artists. The 10 artists that I really like. And do some hand movements in the background in case you are watching. So, I'm not going to list these in any particular order. I could never. I couldn't. I couldn't do it. It would be so hard for me to pick um, even like top three artists. I don't know if I could do it, you guys. <laughs> um, also, um, if you want to let me know what you've been listening to below, please leave a comment for me. Leave a comment for me. Um, let me know what your favorite song is right now. So, artists. I'm going to talk about 10 different artists. I'm kind of going to ramble just about whatever comes to mind. Um, some of these artists I may have more to say about than others. So. so, the very first artist I have written, like I said, this is in no particular order, but um, we've got Queen Herbie. Queen Herbie, Queen Herbie, Queen Herbie. Um, Queen Herbie. Queen Herbie is a female rapper. <coughs> I don't really know much about her background other than the fact that I do know that she used to be in a duo. listening to Queen Herbie for, gosh, maybe, probably back in like 2015 or 2016 is when I first discovered, when I first discovered her music. Anyways, so I have a little beverage with me, 
is a coconut LaCroix. And I have blackberry, blackberry, blackberry Tarani syrup in there. So, a little blackberry coconut situation. Anyways, let's read. Herbie. Um, like I said, I've been listening, 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 listening to her music for probably, I don't know, I don't want to count. I'm bad at math, however many years it's been since 2015. The next Bear. Um, when I was writing this list, what I tried to do was write down 10 artists that I really feel like I can listen to their entire discography and enjoy myself. Consider Black Bear to be one of those people that I can listen to his music, um, most of his songs. I do enjoy, I do enjoy, so. Um, the third artist is... I think Drake is kind of controversial right now. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I don't keep up with that shit. I feel bad um, when I say I like Drake. I'm really talking about like, I'm really talking about like Drake, like take care era. Old Drake, old Drake, old Drake, old Drake, old, old, older Drake. I like. Say that I don't listen to his new music. Um, that's definitely not true. I do listen to some of it. Um, another artist. Okay, number four, number four, number four, number four is Young Dolph. Young Dolph. Rest in peace to, in my opinion, a very, very talented, very, very talented hip-hop artist. Um, I am not as into that type of music anymore on a regular basis, on a regular basis. So, I would say... He's still definitely one of my favorites, um, but I don't listen to him that regularly right now. Next, number five, um, no brainer. I keep having to clear my throat. I'm so sorry. 
I think what was the last album? Let me I'm gonna look up what the last album that I really enjoyed of hers was. Oh, I really did enjoy um Midnights, that was a good one. Um, the album that she just released. I like a lot of those songs as well. I haven't been in a T-Swift mood. I have not been in a, like, sad, sad, <laughs> sad music mood, so that's not really what I'm listening to. Um, let's see, um, yeah, I think I really liked, I really liked 1989 as well, 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 um, what else here? So, the next Artist number six on my list is Sabrina Carpenter, another girly pop, girly pop. Another girly pop, girly pop music. Um, I don't have. It's one of the ones that I've more recently, 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 recently gotten into for sure. So, 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 so. Um, I like a handful, a handful of her songs. I like a handful of her songs, so. Seven is Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne. I love old Lil Wayne. I love new Lil Wayne. Um, I have been listening to Lil Wayne since I was probably. Back when I shouldn't have even been listening to music like that, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh no, my kitty. Hopefully he will be quiet. Um, who else here? Yeah, Lil Wayne is definitely one of the artists that I can listen to a lot of his music. A lot. <clears throat> and I really enjoy it. Um, I can like put on an album, an album I could put on. I could put on an album, a few of his albums, and like I like most of the songs on them. So I also mostly listen to older stuff, like I said. Lil Wayne was really popular when I was in high school, probably like a freshman, sophomore in high school. Um, what year was that? Oh gosh, I don't even know. Maybe like 2009. Um, number eight on my list is... Justin Timberlake, I feel like, is just a classic. A classic. He's a classic. I love his music from the early 2000s, you guys. I love music from the early 2000s in general. My throat is so dry. My throat is so dry. 
kind of struggling to talk there. The camera angle is probably slightly different in like all of these clips because my phone storage, my phone storage has to cut me off three times. Three times, right? Anyways, so I was talking about really a big fan of a lot of his stuff from the early 2000s. Um, let me pull up a few just because really love a lot of the stuff off of Oh yeah, so, like, what goes around comes around. What goes around, what goes around, what goes around, what goes around. What goes around comes around. My love featuring T.I. What else? Oh. Oh yeah, oh my gosh. I being in high school, riding the bus with my little headphones in. My little headphones in just like this, just like this. My little headphones in just like this. And I'd be blasting mirrors by Justin Timberlake. By Justin Timberlake. <laughs> That's a good has a, a lot of great music. A lot. A lot of great music. Um, okay, number 10 is kind of like, I don't know how to describe them. So, if you know who Cody Ko and Noelle Miller are, then you know who TMG is. TMG. And that stands for Tiny Meat Gang. Yeah, it does. It stands for Tiny Meat Gang. Um, they make a lot of funny music. Um, it's kind of hip hop. I suppose that's what you would call it. Like, it's like hip hop. Like rap, I guess. I will let you do your own research on go ahead and check them out. They have a song called Broke that I like. Wait, let me, let me recommend you a few. Let me recommend you a few. Um, oh, Broke Bitch, excuse me. <coughs> Definitely recommend Broke Bitch, Walkman, no flex. Um, I think those are all my favorites. Yeah, I really like those. They make some funny music. podcast I listen to nowadays is Mel Robbins, so. Okay, number 10. We finally made it to the 10th artist. I told you guys this was gonna be a long one. You're welcome. 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 Um, number 10 is Kanye West. Again. Kanye is pretty controversial. Um, you probably either love him or hate him. I think he's a very strange person. Um, 
I'm not going to dive too deep into Kanye as a human. Okay, we're going to talk specifically. So, um, specifically, I really love the Life of Pablo album. The Life of Pablo album. I remember when that album was released. I was in college, and it was on repeat every day. It's a lot of feel-good songs. A lot of feel-good songs on there. Very much reminds me of summer. Um, I still listen to it a lot. I still, I still, I still listen to it a lot. So, those are. in no particular order because I could never do that, but lastly, um, because this video is already pretty long, I'm gonna go ahead and quickly um, go through 10 songs that I've been listening to recently. Um, number one Number one is Run Your Mouth, Run Your Mouth, Run Your Mouth by the Marias. Number two is Hey Mama, a Jimmy remix by the Black Eyed Peas, the Black Eyed Peas, the Black Eyed Peas, the Black Eyed Peas. Number three. Shade in the 90s by Queen Herbie. Number four, Mint, 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 Mint by Queen Herbie. Number five, Chun. by Drake and 21 Savage. Number eight, Miss Independent by Kelly Clarkson. Number nine, I'm a bee by the Black Eyed Peas. And lastly, number ten, Bags by LaKaylee47. Um, it's spelled L-E-I-K-E-L-I-47. LaKaylee47. Like I said, like I said at the beginning, this video is heavily sponsored. <laughs> heavily inspired. I wish sponsored, but anyways, 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 not sponsored. Heavily inspired by Matt. you can check him out. Um, I'll try to find and link the video that I'm talking about, that I'm talking about, um, where he talked about his music taste, his music, his music taste. So, thank you guys so 
so much for watching. I... I love you. I love you, friend. I'm so happy that you chose to spend some time with me. And... 